guys, it's Erica from Erica Marie Plans and welcome back to my channel for a haul. This haul is so long overdue. I've had these things for well over a month, almost coming close to two months, I'm pretty sure with these ones. Um, long story short, this was technically the last clip of my haul previously that you guys have never seen because um, I have filmed a very big portion of it back in the end of August, I think. No, maybe it was the beginning of September. Anyway, when I got all my stuff, I didn't push record and I had filmed a big portion of the haul and I had to reorganize it in my collection and everything. And then when I went to go upload it like onto my iMovie to have it edited and uploaded and everything, it was not there. So I, of course, just didn't press record. That has never happened to me for how long I've ever been like filming plan with me's and like hauls. I have never done that. It would have been like, I feel like this is the worst case scenario because at least in my plan with me, I can go back and show you guys, like just kind of do a flip through if that had ever happened. But it happened in a haul and it was a big portion of things. Um, I can't even remember, I think some of the stuff was like from Once More With Love, I had some Scribble Prince Co stuff, um, Adorably Amy Designs, which I was so sad I didn't get to haul that in a video for you guys because that was my first time shopping with her and I loved all the scripts. Um, you have probably seen them in like my plan with me's recently because I use them all the time because I love how small they are. Um, but there were just so many shops and I'm so mad at myself that I didn't push record and this was gonna be like the second portion of that haul and I filmed it and everything. Um, but I'm just gonna refilm it now, have this uploaded for you guys probably today. Um, today is Friday the 23rd. So I'm just gonna film this quick haul bit and then upload this for you guys. And then my next haul for next month, it probably won't be up till later on in the month because we are traveling again next month for a big portion of that time. And, um, but I'm gonna have like so many things cause I have been buying a lot lately. Um, and the reason why this one is also so small is just because I was on a no spend for the last half of August and all of September. So I really didn't spend much, um, but this is what I got. So I hope you guys enjoyed this. If you guys are interested in seeing this haul, which is gonna be smaller than most of my hauls, um, then keep on watching. All right, this first shop is Letters to Apollo, and this was a $2 Tuesday a while back ago. Um, and I just haven't hauled it. I have used a couple of them. Um, I did hold off for quite a while, but I just couldn't do it anymore. So there are a couple stickers that are missing. Um, so let's go ahead and get started. This one's actually smaller than the others, I didn't realize. I prefer smaller fonts just because I use a lot of little things in my plan with me because I feel like I fill up as much as I can in each day. So I do like the smaller ones, but this one's like significantly smaller. I did not notice that until right now. But um, these are TLR Tuesdays. You can use my code Erica10 to receive 10% off of your purchase. That does exclude TLR Tuesdays because it is already discounted. Um, so like towards her kits and new releases, um, you can use that code, but $2 Tuesdays and I'm pretty sure like the Oops grab bags, um, those you cannot use my code on. Um, and yeah, so let's go ahead and get started. I do have, I think, five orders coming in from Jessica. So next month, you guys will see a really big um, portion from her shop. But this first one I got was Hungry AF. Oh, I keep like getting, I have so much to add. So this is her AF line that came out for $3 Tuesday. She needs to come out with these like on her shop. I know she has a sampler sheet of like one of each one on a sheet, um, but this is like my favorite line she's ever come out with for $3 Tuesday. I think this is so just functional because I can use a lot of these because I feel at least like one of these I can use a week, um, just depending on how I feel, but like it pretty much covers all of my emotions and feelings and just everything. So I am so happy with this purchase. Okay, first one is Hungry AF, Sleepy AF, Spendy AF, which I'm gonna be using this week, um, Stressed AF, Tired AF, Emotional AF, Lazy AF, Anxious AF, Sick AF, Hot AF, Busy AF, mad af productive af blessed af and hungover af 
There are a couple I didn't get. I don't remember which ones, but I think there was only like two or three I didn't get because I didn't feel like they, um, like I would use them. But out of all these, I think there was only two or three I didn't use. So she did a very good selection of picking these and I am so happy with this purchase. And I think that is everything that I got from Letters to Apollo. Okay, this next shop is Kinsey's Creations. I also have a PR code for her. You can use Erica Marie Plans to get 15% off your order. Um, and this is like my first PR order. And so I have my PR freebie, which is my first PR freebie from any shop. Um, I am so excited. So I did have, I think she gave me like six of them, maybe five or six. I only have two left. Um, I did give some... I gave one to my dad, one to my friend Gabby, I think one to Dean, I can't remember, but I was just like so excited I wanted to give it to them. Um, so my dad has like his displayed on his desk, which I think is so funny. Um, but here is my freebie you can get if you use my code Erica Marie Plans to receive 15% off. Um, we got to pick what we wanted on our freebies. And of course this one, Morning Coffee, I feel like it's like my, like, my script um i think she might have it in her shop now but i use this every week this is like my all-time favorite script so of course i was like the number one i needed to have on there so we have morning coffee grocery run planning time binge watch target run tidy up facetime relax and cuddle time so if you guys want this freebie you can just put my um, discount code in the promo box and you will get your discount and this freebie and then for the month of October this is the freebie that was handed out so we have um, a set up new planner decorate fall drink spooky movie um, pumpkin cream cold brew happy Halloween advent arrive sweater oh my god sweater weather and then trick-or-treat so that is your freebie for the month of October. And then first I'm gonna show you the stuff I did purchase. I think this is, yeah, okay. So these are the scripts I did purchase. Um, I actually purchased my first foil from Kinsey and I'm absolutely in love with it. I don't ever really buy myself foil because it gives me anxiety having to pick every single foil to like have in my collection but I have narrowed it down kind of I mean instead of getting all three foils of gold rose gold and silver I did omit rose gold because I don't use it very often and switched it with hollow so I still have three foils I need to get every single time but I did stick with my gold or my plain black for some of them that I know I won't be using every single week but for the ones I use a lot I was like you know what just get the foil you use it all the time so that is what I did this time around. Um, so the first custom script I got is tacos because we have been making a lot of tacos in the house um, and I'm tired of writing it in myself. So I decided to get a script and I just got it in black. The next one is with Dean. I have had these in the past, but I've used them all up. Um, and I think I may still have the other fonts with this script, but um, I didn't, I ran out of the one that's in her like, um, script writing so I got with Dean and then I got morning coffee in all of the foils so we have gold um, silver and hollow and I love that hollow I've been okay you guys know I've said this for so long that I have never been a fan of hollow I don't like hollow I've always been against it but I'm kind of really liking hollow um, my next plan with me that'll be up on Sunday, I think, um, I used hollow and I love the way it turned out. And then the rest I just got in hollow because I don't have much of a hollow collection because of that reason. So I wanted to get my hands on some of the scripts I use quite often in hollow that I do have in like all the other um, foil colors already. So we have laundry, which I love this, like the way she writes laundry in her script font, um, meeting, to make sure there you guys can get a little like shine and then the youtube one which just has film edit and upload and then this was her new releases that came out last week um 
think it was last week. I don't know. I don't even know like what days are anymore. Like everything just kind of mixes together. So um, she did come out with these. They're still available on her shop, I think. Um, this one I'm really excited for. So this is her first time doing full box overlays and it's in orange foil, which is so cool. So I did post this on my Instagram, um, but now I'm just showing you guys in my on my channel. So um, I will be using this for Halloween. I don't know which one yet. I need it. I might use two. I don't know. I don't like, I most of the time don't like using two full box overlays that have like quotes in them in a, in a spread, but I like this so much. And so it definitely will match my Halloween spread this year, which I'm so excited to use because it's from a new shop. Um, well, technically I have purchased from her before, but um, I've never used any of her kits. So I'm really excited to be using that and I'm excited to film that plan with me. So these are the full box overlays. We have Witch Please, if, you're, if you've got it, haunt it. Resting Witch Face, oh my gourd. Um, all my girlfriend, oh my God, yeah. It's like goals or ghouls. So ghouls friends, all my ghoul friends. <laughs> I'm sorry, I'm like not good at this. Or right, total witches. Um, I put the boo in bougie. That one is so funny. I forgot who came up with that. Maybe it was Kinsey. I don't know. Like in our group um, chat, I we're all like coming up with these except me because I I can't come up with anything. I feel like I'm not creative enough for this stuff. But they were like coming up with so many. So, um, and then we have even witches need coffee, which I love that one. That one is so funny. And then happy fall y'all. So definitely get your hands on these. If it's still available in her shop, they're definitely going to be used in my planner this year. And then these were her new releases that she came out with this. I'm so excited for because I am constantly running out. I don't know how, well, I do have two planners, but these are just the months and you just put them in the corner of your Erin Condren or just whatever planner you use if it doesn't have the month on there. Um, and that's what I do, but I've had run out recently because I have two planners. Um, so I'm like using double the amount I should be. So we just have every single month. I'm not gonna go through all of them because you guys know the months of the year, but that's what they are in there and they're in her script writing. And then, these are the, all, the new releases as well. So we have Bake, which I already have. I did get this as a custom couple purchases ago. Boba, which I was going to get as a custom, but when I saw these were coming out, I was like, oh my gosh, perfect. She like knew exactly it, like I needed these. Um, and then we have Sweater Weather, Voiceover by All The Stickers. I love that one. I forgot I had this, so. I should have used it in my last time with me. Um, and then this one's a um, Halloween movie sampler. So we have Hocus Pocus, Haunted Mansion, Friday the 13th, Monster House, Adam's Family, Nightmare Before Christmas, Scream, Twitches, which I think might be the only one I will watch this year. Um, I'm not a big Halloween person or anything like that, but I do like Twitches. Um, and I'm sure it's on Disney Plus. Um, Casper, Carrie, Caroline, Beetlejuice, Hotel Transylvania, It, and Halloween Town. And then we just have your generic fall sampler, which has watch spooky movies, visit pumpkin patch, go apple picking, sweater weather, buy boots, light fall candles, drink apple cider, bonfire nights, roast marshmallows, bake pie, go to haunted house, visit corn maze, buy all or buy fall stickers by Fall Stickers, she has that twice, and then um, Church Treat. So that is that one. And then we have Pumpkin Spice, Sale Starts, and Appointment. So those were all our new releases, and I'm sure she'll be coming up with new releases again soon, so make sure to check out her shop. But that is everything from Kinsey's Creations. All right, the next shop is the Coffee Monsters Co. I did purchase this during her birthday sale, which was back in September, so I've had this for a long time. Um, this. I just picked up a lot of restocks and just some of her new releases that I didn't have. Um, so let's just go ahead and get started with this. So first I did purchase two of these of the Lazy Day Emoti outfits. I have gone through this sheet so fast and 
wanted to make sure to get my hands on two of them this time because of how fast I went through them. I just like marking these for my morning coffees, my early mornings, or just whenever I have a PJ day. So I did get two. And then the next one is the feeling achy and sore emojis. Um, I do have like back pain ones from Glam Planner, but I feel like this just kind of covers everything. So I thought this was a great um, sheet to have. And then we have iced coffee emojis. I've been having a lot of iced coffee lately and I just wanted something to have to mark that. And then we have fatigue emojis, which has been me as well. Um, especially during work. Work has been so slow and when it's slow, it just makes my day go by so much slower and just makes me feel more tired. So I will be using that to mark those days. Then we have stomach trouble, which, oh, that's what I forgot. I just placed an order with Kinsey's Creations and I was gonna get a custom of like tummy aches. I've been writing that a lot in my planner because I've been having a lot of like tummy aches a lot. So, or stomach aches. I don't, Dean always makes fun of me because I say tummy. And I think it's just from like working with kids most of my working life. Um, so I always like, I don't know, there's some things I say that just are like, you could be talking to a kid. But um, this is the stomach trouble ones and we're getting off on a tangent now. So um, I can use these a lot. And then I also got, I think, I, yeah, I did. I got two of these because Friends is one of my favorite shows and I, I'm gonna start it again, I think, because I have HBO Max now. Um, so I did, when it was on Netflix, I rewatched it. I also watched it when I was younger, when it was on TV. Obviously I didn't start it in 93 cause that's when I was born, but I did start watching it when I got a little bit older and then I watched it till the end. Um, so I think I'm gonna watch it again for the third time. And I wanted to have these to market and I just wanted a sheet just to have because I think it's so cute. And then I also got the vacuuming emojis because I can never have enough of these. I just felt like I was using the same stickers over and over again. So I wanted to have a different option. Sorry, oh my God, can you hear my stomach? I have not eaten yet and it's super early in the morning. Um, and then we have a grocery run and so dang excited. I love this sticker. I got it on a freebie a while ago and I used it a couple months ago and it was sad I didn't have like a sheet. So I bought it when she was having her sale. And then the last one is the fruit emojis. Um, just to mark, I don't know. I did use like this, I think it's a strawberry one because we had strawberries or something. I don't remember, but I thought these were really cute. And that is everything I got from the Coffee Monsters Co. Okay, last but not least, I feel like this is a long haul just because I'm talking a lot. Um, so, Thank you if you're still here. Um, the last one is the, what is this? October Mystery. Um, this, okay, I'm gonna go on a little, I don't know if it's a rant. I'm just frustrated. I could just be frustrated with myself, but um, this was shipped to my house in Arizona and I had changed the shipping address to be shipped to my house in California because I knew we weren't gonna be home and I didn't want it in the mailbox like in the heat for two weeks while we were gone. But I don't know if I like didn't do it in time, but I, I don't know. This is, I feel like this could be taken in a wrong way, but I'm just like upset because it was shipped to my house here in Arizona after I had changed the shipping address and it was just in my mailbox. Luckily everything's fine, but the last time my stickers did get a little warped because they were just chilling in the mailbox for two weeks in the heat. Um, so yeah, and then I know Mystery Kit just shipped, I think yesterday or the day before, and I had changed my address back to the Arizona one to make sure that it was gonna be shipped here because we're gonna be here for a few more weeks and it's shipping to my house in California now. So I'm so confused on when the address needs to be changed. I thought I gave it like ample amount of time to kind of switch over, but I guess not. So I don't know what to do at this point. Um, I'm not gonna get my kit for a few weeks after it's already arrived. Um, so I'm trying to figure that out. Even right now as we talk, I'm trying to figure out what's gonna be the best way of doing it. Um, but yeah, so I'm just frustrated with myself, I think, because I don't think I did it right. But let's just go ahead and get started. This was the October Mystery Kit. Um, here are the full boxes. 
this kit, I like the kit. I like the pinks. Um, I can't remember which YouTuber said this, but I completely agree. It is a little like flat looking. Um, I feel like I'm talking bad about Scroll Pins Co. right now, and I really don't mean to, but it's just my opinion. Um, I don't know. It's not as like fun and I don't know how to explain it. Let me let me know what you guys think about this kit if you do subscribe to her mystery kits. Um, I mean, I really like the colors a lot. I like the deep pinks. I feel like I will probably use this in February. Um, this does kind of remind me of like a self-love, me time type of February kit because I don't like using Valentine's kits for the whole month of February. I just like using it on Valentine's and then using like pink me time kits for February. I do like this bottom washi. I don't remember seeing that. And then this is like a new format, which I completely forgot until right now. So you have your fashion girls, some extra like third boxes, your 15 millimeter bottom washi, and then your glitter headers and your extra boxes. So that was that kit. And then the extras we got are just a wiggle in gold. And then we also got a like air freshener, which when she came out with those, I think it was like two years ago with the cinnamon one um, and like the Christmassy ones. I loved those. I still have some like packaged up because I don't want to use them. But this one that came out, I should go get it. I actually have it downstairs in my bathroom <laughs> because it reminds me, it smells like a cleaning product. I don't know. So I did have it like hanging on my um, tripod here, but it was very strong and smelled like cleaner so i was like this is definitely like a bathroom scent so i just have it on the door in our bathroom and i mean our bathroom smells really good but i would not recommend putting it in your car um it's definitely like a house scent and also i'm trying not to like use candles or scents like that because i am trying to go non-toxic which if you guys watch my plan with me you know that i've been using my oils and stuff I'm sorry, this whole video is like going off on a tangent now. I just am in a very talkative mood. Um, but that is everything from this haul. Um, and that is everything I got from a Scroll Friends Go. All right, guys, so that is going to complete this haul. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Like I said, it is smaller than most of my hauls, but that's what happens when you're on a no spend. Um, so if you guys are interested in any of the shops that I had purchase from this month um make sure to check the description down below for the links and also i do have coupon codes um for kinsey's creations and letters to apollo i also have uh one other shop i guess i don't know i do have one other shop for sure um there is another shop that will have a very exciting announcement soon that i can announce i think today later on i don't know i'm not going to say it um, but if I'm able to, I will have that shop linked down below as well. I'm super excited. Um, but thank you guys so much for watching. If you're not subscribed, make sure to hit that subscribe button. If you guys like this video, make sure to hit that like button as well. And follow me on Instagram, which is Plans. And I will see you guys in my next video. All right. Bye guys.